Hey, it's Coach Tom Ferry. Welcome to Life by Design, your place online for ideas. What? Inspiration? Yes. And how to stay in action. I want to talk to you about something I read just a few days back, the 2011 Consumer Trends. What's going on with us? What are we thinking? What are we feeling? What's important? What do we need to focus on? I'm going to put a link on it here so you can download and read it as well. The thing that really stood out for me was the very first one, the very first consumer trend where they talked about, and why is this important? Because we got to know what our peeps are thinking. We got to know what buyers are thinking, sellers are thinking, your neighbors are thinking, and what you and I are thinking. The first one was random acts of kindness. That the market's the market, the world's the world, the economy's the economy. That we're going back to like a like a 1940s conversation where you know you see your neighbor outside and they need some help, you jump out there and you help them. I'm not saying that you're not doing that today, but they're seeing this as this trend. And you know we see it where families moving in together, people co you know commingling, supporting one another in different ways because of what's happened in the economy. They're saying it's a consumer trend now. The thing that I caught on though is they called it. Generation Generosity. Generation Generosity. Pound Gen G. I've already put it out on Twitter. I've already made a Facebook fan page. Go to coach, you know, or Facebook.com forward slash Generation G. And my goal of it is real simple. How many random acts of generosity can we begin to do? Now, when you read the article, and I, of course, I studied it, you know, this is what I got. Yes. Bill Gates and Warren Buffett are running around the world trying to talk to all the billionaires saying, give half of your wealth back to make a difference for the planet. That's cool. It's huge. It's exciting. It's ambitious. What I dug was, it was about just guys and gals like you and me just making a difference for the people that are around us. Just, you know, putting a smile on somebody's face, you know, telling them a joke, giving them a pat on the back, reminding them how good they are, or you know what, like I just did with one of my neighbors, helping them find a job in a challenging economy, introducing them to contacts that I have. I think the question that personifies it is, how can I help you win? How can I help you win? And I'm wearing still, you know, I talked about it not too long ago, uh, my dear buddy Mike Moore, who passed away last year, you know, amazing guy, they created a foundation for him, Live More, Love More. Mike's question that he asked every person was, how can I help you win? He personified generation generosity. So my question to you on this beautiful Friday is, how can you help some people win? We all know Zig Ziglar's great old line, you know, if you help enough other people get what they want, you always get what you want. In the article, they didn't say it was about, uh, you know, that natural law of give to get. You know what they said? It's just about making a difference. We're in the brand business. We're in the people business. This is a no-brainer for you and I. So jump on it. Not just today, not just tomorrow, but maybe make it something you do every day, consciously. Remember always, your strategy matters. And now more than ever, your generosity, and that could just be your passion, really rules. Talk to you soon.